Asante sana. Asante sana. Kwanza kabisa ni kukaribisha wakazi wa Meru County. Songa hivi. You have done this before. Uh, ni kukaribisha wakazi wa Meru County katika uh, afisi za UDA headquarters. Feel at home karibuni sana sana sana. Na kabla tuanze kabla kabla tuanze mkutano tungependa tu kuwafundisha jinsi vile sisi usalamiana hapa kwenye chama. Tukisema UDA mnasema kazi ni kazi. Tukisema kazi ni kazi mnasema UDA Kazi ni kazi. Kazi ni kazi. So I will do the official uh, uh, press statement and then I will invite the chair to welcome Governor Kawira Mwangaza into the UDA party. Members, members of the press and the general public, yesterday in the most tragic and unfortunate incident, the Meru County Assembly Deputy Speaker, Honorable Mwenda Ali and a section of his family, were involved in a grisly accident along the Meru Embu Highway, his car ramming into an ongoing truck. Honorable Mwenda was on his way to Nairobi to see his, of his wife who was scheduled to fly to India for specialized treatment. Sadly, the deputy speaker, who also doubles up at the MCA Fungia ward, lost his two daughters to the accident while he sustained serious injuries that saw him hospitalized. At this difficult time, the UDA party wishes to extend its prayers and sympathies to the deputy speaker, his family, friends, and indeed the entire Meru County fraternity. We send our sincere condolences for the loss of the young souls. While we wish the deputy speaker and his ailing wife a speedy recovery. In honor of the departed angels, may I request that we be upstanding and observe a minute of silence. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, beside the somber mood, we find ourselves following the tragic news from Meru County, ladies and gentlemen, we gather here to host a delegation from that county led by none other than the governor, Her Excellency Kawira Mwangaza, who is here to show her solidarity and affirm her friendship with the UDA party. UDA considers Meru County as one of its bedrock in support and support base and a major hinchpin for its political activities. In the last general elections, our party leader, His Excellency President William Samoy Ruto, garnered 369,362 votes, translating to an impressive 80.87% of the total presidential votes cast in the county. This is remarkable. UDA, uh, Governor Kawira has demonstrated her still in the county politics, demonstrated particularly in how she overcame many odds and political waves to clinch the seat in 2022 as an independent candidate, beating some of the most seasoned politicians, not only in the county, but in Kenya. Whereas Governor Kawira, as an independent an independently elected governor is bound by the provisions of Section 14 of the Political Parties Act 2011 and revised in 2022 
uh, from officially joining any political formation, her support base that moves to UDA today affords us deeper foothold and entrenchment in the county, even as we continue our march to 2027. Mm -hmm. UDA is employing the gather and all and uh, gather all scatter none philosophy and is more than pleased to bring the governor's support base on board at time when we are commencing the party's grassroots elections exercise countrywide. We urge all members and supporters of the UDA party in Meru specifically to embrace this team and work together towards our common goal of building our party. And we must say that we have the blessings of our party leader and our deputy party leader in welcoming Governor uh, Kawira to the UDA party. Governor Kawira has shown interest in vying uh, on the UDA tickets come 2027. And Governor, and Governor, we want to assure you, UDA party is a party that believes in women leadership. This is the first ruling party in the history of Africa to have a woman chairperson leading a ruling party. <laughs> Governor Kawira, I know UDA party has now become even stronger in Meru County. I would like to beseech Governor Kawira and your team as you retreat to go to Meru County. Let us now have reconciliation in the politics of Meru County. UDA is not a party of conflicts. UDA is not a party of fights. Rather, it's a party that believes in inclusivity. It's a party that believes in tolerance, and especially political tolerance. We want to urge the UDA members who founded uh, the party in its initial stages. And we have a lot of confidence with our elected members of parliament, we have a, a lot of confidence with our members of county assembly. We want to ask them to embrace the entry of the governor and they should work together as a team. That is the aspiration of our party leader. Our party leader wants a united Meru. Our party leader wants a solid Meru county government. We are stretching an olive branch to the members of the county assembly in Meru County. As a party, we shall retreat and find a rec reconciliatory mode in which you will operate with the governor because now it is time to move on. So I will allow, uh, first of all, before uh, I allow the chair, we want to officially welcome uh, Governor Kawira as a friend to UDA party ahead of the 2027 elections. rapi niko na kof kidogo ambayo inanisumbua nikiongea lakini hii ni siku ya furaha kubwa sana sisi kama familia ya UDA and even me as a person I'm very happy kwa sababu today UDA is stronger in men si ni kweli na vile awa 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 SG amesema hii ni chama ambayo imefungulia kila mtu mlango Dio watu waingie kwa sababu any person coming in adds value to the party, makes the party stronger. Na kwa hivyo my sister, I want to take this opportunity to formally welcome you into the UDA fold and into the UDA party. 
as the SG has said, this is a party where we make everybody comfortable. And this is the party where the women are even more comfortable. So, Mama Kawera, uko nyumbani, mahali utachungwa, sawa sawa. And I want to take this opportunity. Mimi kama chair wa UDA party, but pia kama neighbor wa Meru. Kusema wakati of healing Meru County politically is now here. I'm urging all the politicians, especially the UDA members of parliament from Meru, the UDA MCAs of the Meru County Assembly from Meru, I want to urge them to open the doors for dialogue, for reconciliation, for healing of this great county called Meru. After Sisi Tukiwa neighbors, we are very worried for Meru. Kwa sababu, wakati kuna vita, kazi aiwezi endelea vizuri. For the governor to perform, she needs the support of her MCA. Sini ukweli? And I want to give the example of Embu County. Hata kama nilingia na UDA, na nikakua tuko na MCAs wa UDA ambao wamechagulia na wengine wakonominated. Wale wambao walingia na Jubilee. Wale wambao walingia na Mbas. Wote tunafanya kazi kama kitu kimoja. And I want to beg watu wa Meru County. Tafadhali nisikizeni. Embu County to lose opportunity kubwa sana ya development kwa sababu ya vita ya kisiasa. Naomba Meru County kwa sababu nyinyi ndio big brothers ambao tumekuwa tukiwainga. Tafadhali turudi kwa meza, tuongee kama viongozi, turudiane, tusaidie ku support mama ndio aendelee kufanya kazi mzuri kwa watu wa Embu wa Meru County. Na mimi mwenyewe am willing like a good neighbor and the chair of the UDA party to reach out to our brothers and sisters so that we can agree to work together as a county. Na nataka kusema it is a problem ambayo imesumbua the president kama party leader, the deputy president, masaa ile imetumika tukijaribu kurudia ku, kuongea na viongozi wa pande zote ni masaa ambayo tungetumia tukifanya development si ndio so mimi nawaomba na nawasihi tutafute hii opportunity ambapo pia tunaomboleza familia ya deputy speaker tutumie hii opportunity to heal Meru county because when Meru county people are happy the people of Embu County are happy. Yes. When Meru County people are happy, Mount Kenya is happy. And Kenya will be happy. Yes. Atutaki vita yendele, na vile SG amesema, we want to embrace a reconciliatory path going forward. Kutoka leo, ata nyinyi mukirudi manyumbani, museme sisi tumekuja kushikana na nyinyi tu weke E, hii chama ya UDA nini? Guvu na tupatie mama Kawera nini? Guvu. Na tumpatie support ile anahitaji ndio aendelee kufanya kazi. And I want to say that we are happy as a party na nyinyi watu wa Meru tunawapenda. Mimi mwenyewe nimefurahi sana kuwaona hapa na tutashikana pamoja kuhakikisha kwamba Meru imeenda vizuri. As you live here mkumbuke kwamba Jana tumeketi katika National Steering Committee ambaye president yalikuwa chair ana chair hiyo meeting na tumeweka mikakati ya kuanza grassroots elections katika chama and Meru will be very key katika hizo grassroots elections grassroots elections za chama Meru zitakuwa tarehe kumi mwezi wa 8 
10th of August. Kwa hivyo muende, register as members of UDA party. Simutaongeza members wa UDA. Register, prepare for the elections. And we pray that by the time to fike kwa hizo elections, tutakuwa tumerudisha meru as one united county, as was the case in the past. Otherwise, tuko na nyinyi, we support you fully as the county of Meru, and we look forward to uniting the leadership of Meru County. To the MCS, we will be sitting down soon, we'll be reaching out, so that we can talk how we are going to move the county government of Meru. So hata kama kuna wengine ambao wako hapa, especially those from the UDA party, Nataka mukiwapata, greet them, shake their hand, and tell them it is time to work together with Mama. And that we'll be looking forward to sitting down with them, to onge, because to be honest, miakambili sikaribu ishe sasa. Sasa tukiendelea na hii vita miaka wa tatu, ya ine, ya tano, si itakuwa ngumu, itakuwa ngumu sana kwa watu wa meru. So ni wakati wa kurudisha viongozi wote pamoja. Kurudisha Meru County pamoja. And I want to tell you that is the thing that the president wants us to do. And that is why him and his deputy asked me to be here today to receive this great lady from Meru called Kawera Mwangaji. So best wishes, mukirudi nyumbani musalimie wale mumeacha uko. Ukienda kwa runinga, ukienda kwa social media, talk the language of unity so that Meru can heal once and for all na mumekaribishwa sana, sana kwa chama ya UDA, chama ya kazi ni kazi. Na kwa sababu naona uko kwenu munachapa kazi, mumengia nyumbani kwa chama ya kazi ni kazi. Mubarikiwe sana, ngaia muradime, murungu wa mudarime, minake na muno. Thank you. Um, sasa nita invite my sister, Governor Kawira Mwangaza, na ye apatiane her acceptance speech. Karibu. UDA. Kazi ni kazi. Kazi ni kazi. UDA. UDA. Kazi ni kazi. Kazi ni kazi. UDA. Na taka ku, kusama ni asanti sana kwa governor mwenzangu, eh, Her Excellency eh, Cecil Barire, jirani wangu, the chair person wa chama tawala chauda. Na taka sema kumpongeza secretary general na viongozi wote, Rebecca, eh, county MP, rafiki wangu sana na viongozi wote na pia kusema ni asanti kwa wameru wote ambao wamefika asubuhi ya leo Mungu awabariki sana. <laughs> pia napenda kuleta pole zetu kama wameru kwa sababu ya deputy speaker wetu ambaye alipata ajali pamoja na watoto wake. Tunaomba kama familia ya Meru na hata kama viongozi Mungu aendelee kuwafariji na Mungu aendelee kuwalinda na Mungu aendelee kuwapatia amani katika hiyo familia. E, pia ningependa kusema siku ya leo ni siku ambayo Mungu mwenyewe amepanga. Nataka kusema this is the Lord's dream, it is marvelous in my eyes. And I believe it is also marvelous in your eyes. Ni tumeomba kama kanisa, mimi kama bishop nimeomba sana. Nimekuja pia na bishop bishop ambao tumekuwa tukiomba pamoja nao ndio Mungu aweze kufungua mlango, aweze kupatiana direction. Kwa muda ambao nimekuwa katika uongozi, nimeshaguliwa 2017 Human Representative Meru kama independent eh, person sikuwa na chama. 2022 pia nikaingia uwanjani, I was partless na Mungu akanipatia nafasi ya uongozi nikiwa governor independent. Na watu wamekuwa wakiniuliza sana uh, governor says Mama 2027 tunaelekea wapi 2027 tupatie sign sasa siku ya leo nimekuja kuambia wa Meru ya kwamba sign ndio hiyo
Sama ni Uda. Na nikaleta marafiki wangu na kuna wengi sana ambao wamebaki Meru. Kwa hivyo hawa ni viongozi kidogo tu wamekuja. Tukiteremka Meru tutafanya sherehe kubwa sana. Kwa hivyo sio siri tena. There is nothing to hide about it. 2027 mimi ni candidate wa UDA. Kwa hivyo mimi ni rafiki sana wa party leader wetu eh daktari excellency eh, William Ruto naibu wake deputy party leader wetu na ninataka pia kusema ni asante kwa sababu ya mwaliko mkubwa sana na hakika this is the party where women belong na party ambaye inajali kina mama <coughs> kwa hivyo kama mama najisikia niko nyumbani and i really want to thank god for that Kwa marafiki wetu ambao wako nyumbani, eh, MCS ambao wajafika siku ya leo, especially wale wa UDA, mimi kama mama kiongozi, nataka kusema ya kwamba, naomba tufanya kazi kwa pamoja. Wow. Kiongozi wengine wote members of county assembly ambao wameingia kwa bus, wengine wako kwa jubili, wengine wako parties mbali mbali, kama mama kiongozi, kwa unyenyekevu naomba tufanye kazi kwa pamoja kwa MPs wetu wote najua Meru MPs wengi ni wa UDA na pia viongozi wengine kama kina CS wetu ni wa UDA na viongozi wote mimi kama mama naomba tena tufanye kazi kwa pamoja vita aisaidia hata kidogo for the benefit of Meru County, na hili Meru yetu yendele mbele, vita hita saidia. Mimi nimefungua milango na mulango wangu, na kusema ya kwamba, njoni tuseme sane, tufanya kazi kwa pamoja, kiinue Meru yetu, kipeleke Meru mbele. God has given us a chance, an opportunity, a noble job, kusaidia watu wa Meru. Na bila unity, God will not command a blessing. The Bible says that Jehovah God commands a blessing where there is unity. Mimi leo na mimi mungu wa mefugua mulangu wa unity. Na tukiteremuka menu nataka kuambia viongozi ambao wako hapa. Atuendi kujigamba ya kwamba kuna mtu wa meshinda, kuna mtu wa mbae ajashinda. Sisi tunaenda kuleta amani, kuunganisha kila mmoja wetu, kuembrace peace, tuambia wenzetu ya kwamba sasa mwito ni mmoja. Na kama vile raisu wetu ya lafio sema ya kwamba, Eh, kazi ni kazi na we must give ourselves a sacrifice ndio Kenya iendelee na hata nchi yetu iendelee naomba pia kama mama kiongozi tuweke everything aside Meru is bigger than any one of us Meru is bigger than any other leader Kwa hivyo ni ombi langu tupatushikane mikono kila viongozi na watu wetu tupeleke ujumbe wa amani tuwapende wote ambao wamebaki kule nyumbani tuseme ni kazi ni kuendelea na kazi ni kazi na Mungu atabariki kazi ya mikono yetu. Kwa hivyo mimi sina la kusema zaidi ya hapo Madam Chair Patson wa UDA ila ni kusema msuo wapi leo na mimi sasa nasema kazi ni kazi. <laughs>
jambo hilo ni ngumu na ni nzito tunaomba Mungu awafariji na pia tunaomba Mungu aweze kumpea uponyaji kwa haraka Now uh, secondly ni kependa kupongeza dada yetu eh, Excellency Kawera kwa kuchukua nafasi hiyo na msimamo kwa atafanya kazi na chama cha UDA tunataka kuwakaribisha pamoja na watu wa Meru karibuni sana katika chama kubwa sana katika hii Kenya in fact uh, this is the second biggest party in Africa after ANC so you've made the right decision and we are very much excited na kama one of the uh, leadership in the organ you are kwamba the chair of the internal dispute resolution committee chair i want to welcome the people of meru to uda and i want to request that you know we have the majority of members of parliament as my colleagues mimi nataka kuomba waweze kuunga mama mkono because if today she has taken that bold step to come to uda then it tells us that she's ready to work with us and therefore i want to request the members of parliament to work with the high excellency kawera i want to request the members of the county assembly to pay mama support because if we support her the people of meru county will get what they wanted by electing her so i uh, high excellency kawera you've made the right decision and i know as our chair sits here and our ex excellency the president who is our party leader plus the deputy president you know the the party leadership of this party are people who are peaceful ni watu ambao wanapenda maendeleo watu ambao wanapenda umoja and you know as our deputy party leader says he's the most truthful man and today we want to speak the truth because UDA is a party of the truth we want to request people of Meru tafadhalini tuachane na kufurugana kwa sababu when we fight the people who suffer are the people who elected us today we are putting all that aside and we are praying that we are going to work together as a party so that we give the people of meru what they deserve kaliboni sana na kama mama ambayo ana settle dispute mimi nita nitahusika pamoja na chair wetu uh, excellency sis plus our sg tusulishe mambo kidogo kidogo ambayo iko uh, meru ili mambo yote yaweze kwenda sambamba Mungu awabariki sana asante <laughs> sasa uh, ni kusema tu kwamba leo hii tukiongozwa na mwenyekiti wa chama cha UDA Governor Cecil Mbarire leo asubuhi tumeweza kuapisha the National Elections Board sasa wako na mandate kamili ya kufanya uchaguzi na tungependa kutangazia wa Kenya wote haswa zile kaunti ambazo zinafanya uchaguzi katika phase 1 kwamba tarehe 26 sasa ni wakati wa kufanya uchaguzi tunaenda kufanya uchaguzi katika kila polling center nchi hii tunaenda kuwa na viongozi 20 20 kwa kila polling centers tukitoka hapo tutaenda kufanya uchaguzi ya ward hapa eh, 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 katika kila ward tutakuwa pia na viongozi ambao wamechaguliwa tena tutoke pale tufanye constituency paka tufanye county elections wale ambao watakuja sasa katika national delegates conference so ningependa viongozi wote haswa wale viongozi ambao ungependa kuwania viti mbalimbali mjisajili mtandao wetu umefunguliwa tena upya kujisajili uende pale ujisajili kama mgombea ya kiti na tutafunga kwa zile counties za phase 1 tutafunga usajili tarehe 12 so mjisajili kwa haraka sana na uongozi huu hauko limited kwa wale ambao wamechaguliwa peke yao ni kila mkenya ako na haki na mwanachama ako na haki kusimama kiti chochote kama ulichaguliwa kama we ni MCA MP uko na haki ya kusimama kiti kama wewe ni mwananchi wa kawaida uwe mama mboga uwe boda boda pia uko na haki that is why tumepunguza bei ya registration iwe ya mtu wa kawaida 200 shillings 
200 shillings you can register to be a candidate at the polling center. Na katika hiyo polling center tumepeana kwamba tuko na vitengo kadha wa kadha. Tuko na vitengo tutachagua watu watatu ambao ni wanabiashara. So hapo mama mboga unaweza kuwa pale ndani. E, kama we ni mtu wa pikipiki unaweza kuwa pale ndani. Tuko pia na nafasi za kuchaguana wale viongozi wa dini. Tuko na nafasi za viongozi wa dini. Tuko pia na nafasi za wakulima pale katika polling center. Nafasi mbili za wakulima kwamba tutatenga nafasi mbili kwa wale ishirini paka tuchague mkulima. Vile vile pia tuko na nafasi ya professional bodies. Kama wewe ni NATO official, kama wewe ni accountant, tuko na nafasi yako pale. Tuko na nafasi tatu, sita ambazo zimetengwa za kina mama peke yake. So we are assured that at every polling center we shall observe the, uh, the one third gender rule kwamba kina mama nafasi zenyu zitatengwa kando na vile vile pia tuko na nafasi za vijana tungependa kusema kwamba UDA ni chama cha kuweka watu pamoja that is why we are keen about inclusivity at the polling center na na mwisho kabisa pia tuko pia na nafasi za wale ambao wanaishi na changamoto za kimwili tungependa kuhimiza wote waeze wania viti so these are party that uh, emphasizes on inclusivity umoja uiano utangamano that is our belief and that is the principle that is steering this party so tunawakaribisha participate and tunawahakikishia kwamba tunaenda kuwa na uchaguzi wa haki sababu ni uchaguzi wa mtandao hakuna kuiba kura hakuna kuhesabu ati hii ni asijui ya nani tuhesabu bali tupe hapana Tukimaliza kufunga voting 2 minutes after tumefunga voting results zinatoka sababu so, utafanya tu okay na zinafanya computer yenyewe inatoa results so hakuna kuhongana this is going to be a very free and fair election so ningependa kukaribisha bishop wetu ambaye pia ni member wa NEC wetu uh, 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 bishop magambo sorry nimekupatia promotion bwana <laughs> Ndirania ni bishop uh, akuje tu atuombe tukifunga mkutano wetu alafu mnaweza baki nyuma tukiimba tukicheza musitoke yeah. mnajua mulia nimeambiwa mku lala jana sasa e, mtapewa nafasi ya kulala hapa leo ndio <laughs> muziki ya kutosha karibuni sana na bishop ukianza maombi unaanza na UDA kazi ni kazi asante sana so, I want uh, to make a statement that uh, Meru County people, residents are very happy because of what has happened. Kina mama wamefurai, waze wamefurai, kijana wamefurai, maka watoto wamefurai. Tumepokea SG, tumepokea many messages here as we are seated here. Meru is already rejoicing because of what has happened. To begin with the SU Makoto. Let us pray. Almighty and everlasting God, we want to thank you for your loving kindness and your tender mercies. Thank you for creating us in your own image and in giving us life and in breathing the bread of life even to our lives. We honor you because you have given us a token of life and we are so grateful that for such a time as this, we can gather here because of leadership of this country and the leadership of the great county of Meru. We want to thank you for what has happened, thanking you for giving us a leader in Meru that has been elected overwhelmingly by the residents of that county. Now that she has come to associate and to work with the ruling coalition, we have no doubt that Meru is going to another glory. We pray that in the name of the Lord, this unit is going to last and it is going to bring development and a tangible happiness even to the people of men. We want to thank you because we, we understand that there is a journey that we are supposed to make in the year 2027. The Bible said many are the plans in a man's heart, but the counsel of the Lord prevails. We want to ask for your counsel and the support such that we shall see the year 2027 and we shall go to the ballot 
and we shall win again. Amen. We want to commend His Excellency, the President and the Deputy before you, praying for them that the spirit of excellence that they have exhibited running this country, they are going to do better and excel greatly in every opportunity that you give unto them. We commend you, the party before your head. It is the second largest party in the continent of Africa. And we pray that UDA will live long and the UDA will be strong. It will move from one glory even to another. Amen. Bless the leader and the deputy leader of this party. Amen. Bless the Madam Chair Reddy and the Secretary General and even the dispute resolution officer. Lord, may you empower them and strengthen them. Amen. We pray for peace in our country. Let there be peace and the unity in our motherland that we shall enjoy peace within our borders. Let the plenty be found within our borders. We thank you for what you have done and we look forward for many great wonderful things that you are about to do. For we ask this in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Amen. God bless you.